bat's got to be in there, sir. What do you think? Deer gas? We'll smoke them out. Okay, men. Ready with your masks. <laughs> in five minutes. Adventures in Chiroptery at the Bat Exhibit will begin in 30 minutes. Hello? Anybody here? Dr. March? Who is it? Bruce Wayne. I have an appointment. I called about a bat problem. What do you think we are? Pest control? Why, well, just need. Yes, yes, come in. Why, thank you, Doctor. You donate a few million and you think you own the place. I understand I'm to analyze something for you? Yeah, Doc. See, I keep hearing squeaks in my chimney. And I found these in my empty fireplace. They look like hairs. I thought maybe you could tell me if I have a bat problem. And what if they are bats, Mr. Wayne? What then? Destroy them like insects? We won't survive the next evolutionary cataclysm, but bats will. They're survivors, Mr. Wayne, not pests. You should understand that. Dad? I hope Mr. Wayne understands you mean no disrespect. Well, of course not, Miss... Oh, Mrs. Well, actually, Doctor. I'm Francine Langstrom. I think you spoke with my husband on the phone? Oh, Mr. Wayne, I'm sorry I'm late. I'm Kirk Langstrom. Did you bring the sample? I gave it to Dr. Moore. Where'd he go? Probably to get started on the analysis. If it's a bat problem, we'll know by tonight. Dad was lecturing Mr. Wayne on the virtues of Chiroptera. Chiroptera what? Chiroptera, bats. And I hope he didn't get carried away. He's a little, uh, protective of all this. I think he likes bats better than people. I can't imagine. I brought you this, too. It's a recording I made of the noise in my chimney. That doesn't sound like any bat I've ever heard, Mr. Wayne. The animal behavior people have a sound library. Maybe they can identify it. We'll let you know. I'd appreciate it. I didn't realize you'd taken up listening to rock and roll, sir. You know, I actually did check this against any musical sounds. Computer still can't come close to pinpointing it. Wayne Manor, one moment, please. A call for Master Bruce from a Dr. March. Hey, what's up, Doc? You have bats, Mr. Wayne. Common brown bats. They shouldn't pose a problem. As the weather gets colder, they'll move on. What about the sound on the tape? It's actually two sounds, starlings and brown bats, probably fighting over a nest in your chimney. Appreciate the help, Doc. I'll return the favor next time you're raising funds. Bye-bye. This computer checked that fiber against every animal species known to man. I went to them because I thought they might know something we didn't. That hair wasn't a brown bat's. And those melodic sounds? Computer, check against combined sounds. Starlings and brown bats. 